everybody and welcome back to my um channel and I am doing a video for the couture stamping um academy and for this um project I am making I'm using I'm using the Avalonia um card making uh, workshop on a go kit now I've actually done a video already um making a card using um doing this pattern here however something happened to my camera and I lost the video before I had a chance to put it onto my um onto my computer and I've already made all five cards so I couldn't go back so um so I will be making a card today. I'm using um pattern number two here. The just because I care. And so I'm gonna make the I'm, I'm gonna make it with you all. I have already pre-cut everything and here goes the finish for, um version. This is um one of them here that I was working on. And then I'm going to do another video on here, but on on the other pattern. But before I get started, I just wanted to um, to tell everybody I started a new a new Ning site, and and it's called Couture Stamping Academy. When I originally started it about a month ago, um, it was in it was around the basis of um. You know, like paper, pa um, paper craft, pl um, planet, where you can, you know, just have a gallery, show off your projects and things like that. Um, and so I created a Ning set, and I wanted it to be based upon close to my heart. Um, I've since had a little bit of a change of heart, just because I love all kinds of crafting. I love close to my heart. I love the other stamp companies that are out there. Um. You know, Pink by Design, Cards TV. Um, I just actually just purchased my first ever um, stamp TV stamp set. Um, I just love everything. And so I didn't want to limit myself on just Close to My Heart. However, the site is still going to be featuring Close to My Heart because there are going to be special um, classes, special... Um, tutorials and things that I use that's, that will be fe featuring close to my heart in the future. So I would like, it's a free site. It's called CoutureStampingAcademy.ning.com and I would love for you to stop by and um, and join the community and, and just showcase your love of crafting, period. Um, so with that, we're going to go ahead and get started. Okay, now with the workshop um, on the go kit, it gives you all of your cutting measurements and how to place your um, paper. Um, your paper. Um, here are your cutting guides, so you'll know on each sheet of paper of how, how much of each, um, excuse me, um, layer you would need and at what size. And then it labels one C, three B. So the numbers are the actual card pattern. So if you see one. This is card number one, or as you can see, it's probably better over here. This is card number one, and so one C is this layer here that's under one D. So it just helps you out, and it takes the guesswork from having to create cards. That's why I love working with patterns and um, sketches because then you don't have to think as much. So in your kit, you're going to get a pack of um, note cards. You're going to get 15 note cards and 15 envelopes. You're also going to get um, a cellophane bag where you can place your um, your finished card. Okay. So. And the cards do come pre-scored. And it's going to be so simple and easy to put these together. Now what I actually done is um I had my own little baggies and I took I cut each um once I finished cutting per the cutting guide, I just placed them in a the bag so I can go to them um very easily. And so in the pattern it tell in the instructions it tell you to adhere two A and two B. 
So this ear, this is right here, is um 2A. So we're going to place this down here. What's that? Oh, here we go. And... Okay, so I'm just going to line this up here. Okay, I think there's a little bit of hang there. Ow. Today is a holiday, and so my daughter is here with me. Wait, is that a holiday? It's Christopher Columbus Day. Oh, I thought I'd say holiday. Actually, you have homework to do. What homework? Your book. What kind of book? I forgot which letter you're on. SH. The SH book. Uh, but, but I do my mm -hmm. paper letter book. Did you print it? One minute. Okay, so now it says 2B. So this is 2B here. So we're just going to run a strip of tape here. My daughter is a little organizer. She always takes my ink pads and puts them back where they belong. I don't know where she gets this deepness from. Where did this go? Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to use the workshop um, on a go card um, stamp set. And this is called, it's just called the Avalonia um, Card Making Workshop. And it has sentiments like thank you from the bottom of my heart it has this nice little background pattern here it has these little goalies and um so we're going to be working with this border and um just because i care and this little um accent piece here so we're going to be working starting with the the border and you're going to bend your border on your block so you can create this pet um I don't even know what to call it this pattern here up at the top so Ow. no 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 it's keep hurting it needs to close <laughs> and so I'm gonna use my little phone sheet here Okay, go ahead and run. Okay, so I'm just going to stamp. Now, you're going to stamp this. It says you slate. I don't have the slate um, ink. So, I'm using my mental um, London Fog. It looks just like it. So, I'm going to line this up to how I want it. Okay, so then this is the beauty of clear stamps because you can then see what exactly is you're doing. And I hope I got this on right. So, close enough. Can you do that over there, please? Okay, so now we're going to put this off to the side. We're going to take our next two pieces. Um, which calls for 2D and 2C, but we're going to do our stamping first. Okay. 
Okay. And using the London Fog again, we're going to stamp the sentiment just because I care. Wow. Okay, and we're going to stamp this right about here. Okay, and then using some chocolate ink that I think my daughter just did you move, move. did you move ink? What, who me? Yeah. No. You had it. I wasn't doing that. Oh, here we go. Well, I was, I was gonna put that away. Yes, I did. See, I knew I wasn't crazy. But I was gonna put that away first. You know, we wasn't using it. Okay, so we're gonna take this piece, um, this stamp right here, and we're gonna place it right about here. I'm gonna yeah. give it a little press. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is okay. So this card stock right here, I believe this is the slate, and I I really like it. Um, because I'm not used to stamping on colored cardstock. I'm used to using just the, um, the colonial white or just the regular white cardstock. Um, so now you're going to take a 7 inch piece of ribbon here. And it, this also comes in your kit. And then you're going to make what they called, um, a 2D... Oh, I'm sorry. I thought it was calling the 2D. Okay. You're going to tie the ribbon around the 2D piece. What? And so I'm, you're just making a little double knot. And I am not the best knot maker. No, 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 no. When it comes to making knots and bows, especially the if I don't have a lot of um, ribbon to really work with, it makes it even that much harder for me for some reason. And I don't really like that knot. So I'm going to take this off camera and I'm going to redo this knot. Okay, so I went and did my bow, and I went ahead and layered my piece here. So then we're just going to place this in the middle here. Okay. And so, we're just going to lay this down. And then what? And then you read about what's the word this. Now, this is, okay, now this is now what we're going to do. Okay. We're going to make. My daughter's sitting here pretending like she's doing what I'm doing right now. Okay. It's so cute. Okay, so. What, oh, okay, this came from your kid. I mean, here, here goes a quick shot of her. She, yes, you. She's doing her, her own little crafts. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're just going to put down... I'm not sure what these things are called, but it's like sparkles, but it looks like... To me, it looks like little, little raindrops, but they're so cute, and I love how they feel. So we're just going to place I feel a big one. Ooh, this is good. Right here in the corner. <clears throat> and then we're going to take two medium size. And then what? Oh, they, okay, they call clear bubbles. I miss Miss Wilfer. You don't like the teacher. 
And then. Oh, you can't. Where's the map? Oh. Mom, your phone. I'll get it. It's okay. Where is it? It's just an email. And that completes our card. So I want to thank you for joining me today. And I will be doing another, the, um, the third card, um, that comes along with this Avalonia card workshop kit. And if you're interested in getting this kit, you can visit my website at candacefields.ctmh.com and you can order this kit for yourself. Thank you for joining me. Say bye bye. Huh? Say bye bye. I know you say it. <laughs> bye bye.